Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the post-match presentation of the match between Mumbai City FC and FC Goa. Before I get to the awards, a quick thank you to all our sponsors for their contribution to Indian football. First up, it's time for the club award, and I'd like to invite the captain of the winning team, Mandar Rao Desai, to please come forward and collect a check of 50,000 rupees, presented by Mr. Kandar Chandra, Chief Operating Officer, Mumbai City FC. Well, the club award goes to FC Goa for a four-star performance as they bury more goals and more misery on Mumbai. Season in, season out. Next up, we have the Maruti Suzuki Limitless Player of the Match for rupees 25,000. And it goes to Hugo Bumu from FC Goa. He will collect the award from Mr. Rohit Kumar, Zonal Manager Finance, Maruti Suzuki India Limited. Well, today's Limitless Player was Bumu. Second goal in his second game and showed no fear and bravery when the post was in his way, but absolutely nailed it. The next award of the evening is the DHL winning pass of the match for rupees 25,000, and it goes to Murtado Fall. He will collect the award from Mr. Nirav Shah, Director, Accounts and Tax, DHL Express, India. Slightly bizarre this. Two nights, two headed passes that will win the DHL winning pass of the match award. Matada for this time towering over his man to set up the third. Moving on, the ISL Emerging Player Award is handed out to the outstanding young performer of the game. And today's winner is Sartha Golui. He will be presented with a cheque of 25,000 rupees by Mr. Indranil Das Bla, Chief Executive Officer, Mumbai City FC. Well, Sartak not only got himself a goal, but at times defended the way that you should defend. No nonsense, clearances, very physical and strong. Definitely one for the future. He is the emerging player. It's now time for the final award of the night, which is the Hero of the Match Award for 50,000 rupees, and it goes to Lenny Rodriguez of FC Goa. He will collect the award from Mr. Bimal Pare, co-owner, Mumbai City FC. This man just doesn't get the credit that he deserves sometimes. Lenny had a fantastic season last year, and again, he's been influential on the field this year. Got his goal as well. Lenny, the hero of the match. Congratulations, Lenny. Your first goal for FC Goa, your third different club in the ISL that you've scored for after Bengaluru and FC Pune City. How do you feel? Uh, it's, I'm always happy to score a goal. It's not about me scoring, it's for the team. And uh, I'm very much happy because we got the three points. How was the mood coming into this match? You kind of had an intuition that tonight was the night that you were going to get your first goal for FC Goa? Uh, all the credits go to uh, Mr. Because uh, in half time he told us uh, that you have to keep the ball and uh, play the way we are playing. You know, the away fans here were loud, they were screaming, they were spurring you on throughout a message to your fans. Uh, I would like to thank them because they came from Goa to support us. And uh, in uh, next match also they have to come. We are playing away or home. And thank you so much. Thank you, Lenny, for talking to us. If I could just get the celebration from you once again. And that brings us to the end of the post-match presentation. Thank you.